Hi guys, it's me Maria. Um, sorry I've been in my A. I've had uh, uh, a family tragedy, so I haven't been able or had the energy to um, come up and and um, do videos as I, I normally do Tuesday and Friday. Um, I'm going to see if I can upload a lot of stuff that I've done, not this past a uh, week or so because that's where my strategy happened but um, uh, further back um, but yeah um, sorry I'm a bit so affected by it um, but this weekend uh, Saturday I went to my mo I went with my mom to a convention here in Denmark um, next month we have another convention so I haven't been buying as much stuff as I thought. I've been selling a lot and I've been using that money to buy something new that I really wanted. So um, let me get started. I bought an album and um, it's this album. I've already filled it because I've been having a lot of layouts that um, I haven't been I haven't had room for but this is the black uh, American crafts uh, D ring album and I really love these albums these are the albums that I usually go with when I have to buy some I buy it in pink and I buy it in black so I bought a black one this time and it's all, almost already filled, filled up um, so I bought that and um, I bought I didn't, I didn't really think that I that I bought as much as I thought I would, but I bought this one. This is the Tim Holtz Hardware uh, Findings. I really wanted this one. I've been wanting this one for a long time, and since the new CHA stuff is coming out, um, she said that she didn't know if she was going to have the old dice old, but you guys know what I mean. The old dice left, so I bought it. I had to because I don't know where else to find it unless online and I thought I might as well um, support the store that was there. <clears throat> I also found this border dies and I am really starting to like these. This was 99 kroners and that was 25% off so I got it for 75 kroners. It's not that bad really. Um, really starting to like how to use them also for mini albums and such. I found this die a while back and um, I really liked it but I didn't I didn't buy it so I decided to buy it this time and that one I also got 25% off which I really enjoyed. I love it when they have percentages here in Denmark because they don't always have it so when you do have it you have to be really you have to go get it and uh, I bought some punches also. I bought these. My mom and I call them ring. Martha Stewart uh, around the page uh, punches, and I really like them. This is one of the sets that I have. I really like Martha Stewart punches because they're really easy, but I also have a, a really good eye to the EK six X slim punches that you can clip down and they will stay that way. I also bought this one. I have never seen it here in Denmark but I saw it at that store and I was like I have to have it because I saw a lady on YouTube I believe it was or was it in a magazine where she had a layout where she used it. So that was that one. Um, I also bought a magazine and there was 20% off and that was because they had the steampunk, um, this is a Swedish magazine, they have a, a really, really cool article about the steampunk, uh, style, so I thought that was really neat and I like to see layouts, I like to get inspired by them might not do them the whole, the exact way that they do it, but, um, like, check this out. This is the really cool layout. She has, she uses a lot of Tim Holtz stuff, but I don't mind because I love it, so. <laughs> then 
there's also one here. I really like the clutter style. But it to me, it's, I call it clutter style because I don't know what else to call it. But it is so neat. It looks so funky and, and stuff, so I really liked it. Um, that was basically what I bought. Um, I'm waiting for the new dies to come out. And, and um, next month is my birthday March. Oh, no. Okay, guys. Remember on my blog at uh, justseeme.dk slash blog. I still have, I still haven't forgot about the giveaway that I promised, so keep an eye out for that. But like I said, we had a family tragedy, so I'm trying to get, uh, I'm trying to get back on track and, and do the stuff that I normally do. But I wanted to show you, because he, the, the store that I bought all this at, said that she had a secret at 3 o'clock on that Saturday, and I went, and she showed that machine that my mom and I, um, we split the cost on. Of course she had the dies, and I don't have anyone yet, but I bought that one. That was like a whole set. Um, the deal is that you buy this, the cardstock at her store, and then you have to pay three kroners to get them cut. This was a, this was already in a package that, you, that she has already done, and I just decided to buy it just to see if I could use it for something. That was also something I bought that Saturday. So, I don't think I have any more to show you. Oh yeah, I've been to uh, my local craft store here. I bought some more paper pad that in their name, so it's, it's not that expensive as die cuts with a view or KI memories or whatever all those brands are. But I bought this, and this I'm gonna have to do some experimenting with. This is model paste. And we have a crop here in March that more details are coming up. Um, and look out for this because we're going to be using this. So if you guys want to tag along at ggals.blogspot.com, check out for details. And um, I'm going to have a class description of what I'm going to do on my classes. And um, we're going to be, be using model paste. So if you guys want to tag along, you're more than welcome. Um, but... Check out my blog at justbeme.dk slash blog or the ggals.blogspot.com for further information on the crop. And for my giveaway, I'm going to be giving a, I'm going to do a giveaway as soon as I reach 100 subscribers to my blog. So please go and do that right now and I'll be thrilled because I have a lot of stuff coming up. But um, until next time, I'll see you later. Bye!